hi guys and welcome back to my channel so today the dyson finally came <laughs> you're probably wondering shwana you don't have your eyebrows on no i basically put on some foundation some concealer and a little mascara just in case <laughs> i need to hop back in the shower because i gotta go somewhere so when you're trying out here stuff you don't want to do all your eyebrows and stuff because that takes the longest and if i have to redo everything not saying this isn't gonna work not saying that just you know being prepared because i have to go somewhere <laughs> so yes welcome back to my channel and i've been wanting to try this thing i ordered this like two weeks ago but it took a while to get here which is fine i ordered the dyson airwrap smooth and control one so let's talk about it first um it is for frizz prone hair which i have <laughs> it currently retails for 499 dollars and 99 cents and it is for curl wave it says curl wave smooth dry with no extreme heat the Dyson Airwrap Styler completely resets the world of hairstyling by combining our powerful digital motor with aerodynamics, which we've been able to harness a phenomenon known as the Coenda effect to curl, wave, and smooth hair with no extreme heat. So today, guys, this just arrived. My hair is damp. We're going to do a demo. We're going to do it all. I'm going to try this, this using their blow drying it out of course and i'm going to try the curler without using a flat iron and i'm going to try the curlers using a flat iron and see which one works best we're going to do a full-on thing today so you can know if this is something that you know works for the curly hair the attachments we have a 1.2 inch air barrel air wrap barrels create and set voluminous curls or waves with clockwise and counterclockwise barrels for symmetrical curls. So they give you two different barrel, bur wow, barrels for each side of your head. <laughs> um, a 1.6 inch air wrap barrel create and set loose curls or waves with clockwise and counterclockwise barrels for symmetrical curls. Then I have the firm smoothing brush. Creates a straightener style with less frizz and fewer flyaways with firm bristles engineered to control frizz prone hair. And then the pre-styling dryer it takes hair from wet to damp ready for styling. Okay, so let's open this baby and uh, see if it works for my hair. This is my first ever Dyson product. So I'm a newbie to the Dysons. I've used Dysons before. I just haven't purchased one. Oh, okay. That's pretty. That's beautiful. It says, my wet hair will get off of it. It says Dyson on the front. This is leather, which you should kind of expect it should be. <laughs> um, okay, I open it. And it's velvet right here. And then there's a Dyson, another leather piece to put on top. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Yeah. And this tells you basically what to do, how to curl your hair with Coanda Air. It says to watch the 30 second video, I did watch it. And you're supposed to used to curl the hair using with damp hair so that will be interesting and we will try that <laughs> oh i opened it and it just smells like a new car <laughs> basically you know you get in the leather seats and but this is what it looks like and it's all velvet on the inside it's beautiful it's really pretty so Let's take out some of the pieces. Okay, so this is the straightener. All right. Uh, 
uh, this is the actual attachment that they all go on. This is really lovely. Oh, wow. This is, this is, this is pristinely wrapped. Just beautiful. Oh, that's beautiful. It's pink and it's kind of like space gray, like my computer. <laughs> and this is the plug reset test. This is really pretty, oh my gosh. It has a lock and unlock on here, which is nice. I'm gonna plug this baby in. Okay. What else does it have in here? This right here, which I'm not sure what this is as yet, but we'll find out. <laughs> And here are the barrels. One for each side. They're not heavy. They feel like, they feel kind of like plastic a bit. And here's the dryer so that you can get your hair too damp from wet. All right, well, let's try this first and just see what it does just to turn it on. Okay, you put this on. Oh, oh, okay, so I'm locking this. So unlock it, take it off, and then when I put it on, it locks. Oh, okay, let's see. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh, that's a nice, that's a nice key. It comes out. It's, it's hot guys, it's, it's nice and hot. Not overly hot. This is medium. This is low, okay? Oh, this feels so high tech. I'm not gonna lie. Ah, it feels high tech. <laughs> I live for that type of stuff. Okay. Let's keep going. <laughs> um, I'm gonna try this first, okay? Oh, let me take this off. So I need to unlock it and it comes right off. That This is really innovative. No turning, I just have to put it on there, okay? And what I did on my hair, guys, this side has uh, my Orbe on here, and this side has my uh, just Tresemme heat protectant, which basically is what my hair will look like without any smoothing type of thing on here. So this is where I put my smoothing stuff on. So let's take pieces and see what this does without a smoothing, with a smoothing cream and without a smoothing cream. It's hot. Okay. Okay guys, so I'm back. You're probably wondering why did I do the backs 
instead of the fronts because the fronts I want to show curled and I need to wet them a little bit more. They're, I guess they're still a little damp, but I will, I'm going to put a little bit more water on it to use the curls to see if that uh, works well. So this is the smoothing one and um, this is like a blow dryer to me for my hair. So it is, of course I have the smoothing stuff on this side from the Orbe and you can see that because it's, it's smoother than this side. It's still a little frizzy, but, and I went through it a few times. You guys could see that. I'm sure I can go through it more. This is not taking the place of a flat iron. <laughs> so this basically I would use, okay, I'm blow drying my hair with this instead of my other blow dryer because I don't want heat damage or it's too much heat and I, I want to switch over to something that technology wise is supposed to not damage my hair. <laughs> Let's try out the curlers. The 1.2 is supposed to give me voluminous curls and the 1.2, no, 1.2 is supposed to give me voluminous curls and the 1.6 is going to give me loose curls. So let's try the voluminous curls first. Guys, the thing that I said, I didn't know what it was. It is the, that round thing, it's the filter cleaning brush. All right, guys, we're going to try the 1.2 barrel first and they have a coat shot right here. So at the end, if I wanted to set my curl, I can shoot it with cold air. So they say you take a piece and it's supposed to come to you. So let's go. <gasps> oh. Okay. Okay. Let's, let's, let's try another one. Let me bring the heat down just a little bit because as I got close to my head, it starts to, it's a little bit of a, a burn that's happening a little bit, a little hot. <laughs> I don't curl it. I just let it come to me and just push it up towards my, my head. Okay, um, I could have probably used the other one because this may, this, this probably is supposed to go to this side, <laughs> but you learn. Let's, let's try the one sixth inch, the 1.6 inch barrel. Oh, this is hot too. So be mindful. You might want to let it cool down before you try and take it off or get a paper towel to to take it off, remove it, unlock it. Let's try the one six now. And you're supposed to wait for it to get, uh, for your hair to dry while it's on there. Try a little bigger piece.
Let's see if it works on a dry piece. It works on dry hair. Okay, so let me flat iron a piece out just to see how the curler looks on flat ironed hair. All right guys, I flat ironed a small piece right here to see how this works on the flat iron part. Okay, let's take let's take a smaller piece <laughs> cuz that didn't work very well. Let's take a smaller piece. And I'm going to turn it back on to high. It was on medium. Okay, well, that didn't work too well on my flat ironed hair piece. Um, I don't know why though, why it worked on this piece and not on my flat ironed piece. Maybe I need to try the smaller one. Let me try the smaller one. But you kind of saw it had a difficulty grabbing onto it. Oh, guys, also, though. That's the side that I don't have any smoothing stuff on. So this is just like regular hair. So that could be the reason why. Let me try it on this side again. Okay, yeah. So this smoothing serum that I have on this side helps this side curl. And this side, I don't have any smoothing serum on. But let's give it, let's try it again. This is the part that I didn't do anything to.
Okay. It seems like, guys, though, this needs something to grip onto. So this isn't necessarily for just dry hair that, so my flat ironed hair was too slippery seemingly, but it did, it did uh, curl on this side. Okay. <laughs> Out of all of my stuff, let me go ahead and use this to finish blow drying it. And then I'll come back and tell you my final thoughts on it. Okay, guys. So what, what do I think about this new Dyson um, air wrap styler? I think it's really cool. I think the packaging is really pretty. I think it's really innovative. I think this is a, um, picking my hair out. <laughs> I think this is a hair dryer, sort of, but not necessarily a smoother for me. I would prefer to just use my regular hair dryer because my regular hair dryer actually gets my hair more smoother and this takes a bit longer for me. Um, it's very compact. It's very technologically advanced. It's very cool. But yes, this takes this this takes longer for me than me just using a hair dryer, and my hair is still a bit puffy. As you see, it's, it's puffier on this side because I don't have a smoother on my Orbe smoother straight smoothing straightener thing. I, I forget the name of the <laughs> full thing. But this is how my hair normally looks with my regular hair dryer. And my regular hair dryer, when I have the smoothing stuff on, is a lot smoother. So, but yes, now be mindful, this does not get super hot. It does get, though, hot enough. Like it, you don't want to put your hand on there. It will burn. <laughs> Concerning the other attachments, what do I think about the curlers? I think, well, first this, this is cool. I can use my dimming brush and use this and use this as a blow dryer, but then I could just buy the blow dryer. They have a blow dryer, <laughs> but this is a nice addition that they gave. The curlers, I think the curlers are cool. And I think the curlers are cool if I had less curly hair and if I had straighter hair because when I use the curly attachment, it's meant to be used with damp hair. So as you saw, when I put it on my dry hair, it worked a bit on this side because it had something to grab onto, but if it didn't have any product or something to grab onto, it's not, it's not gonna grab your hair, which is what it's meant to do, which is really cool. I have to say, kudos to Dyson. That was. That's an amazing, cool thing that this thing does. It does get hot. So when you push it towards your head, that heat is real. <laughs> it's real. And I like the fact you can set it with a cold shot. But because I have naturally curly, curly hair, this, not that it doesn't dry right, it just the straightness that I want when I have curls. So I'm looking for curls that after my hair is straight. So I still want my straightness, but my curls at the bottom. What I have to use this for is I have to use this damp. And so using it damp means that puffiness all up here will remain and I can't have my bone straight hair and curl my hair with this to some extent, unless I put a product on with it to be able to, so that this can catch it. I like it, just not for my type of hair and what it was intended to do. I did try it on my dry hair, you saw, and yeah, you can use it for dry hair, but what it was intended to do really doesn't work for the look that I'm going for. Is when So when I wear my hair straight, I'm looking for it to be bone straight and I would curl my hair dry because if I curl it damp, then my hair just looks 
kind of Shirley Temple-esque with puff at the top. <laughs> so yes, I think this is a really cool invention and really cool gadget. Um, I just don't think it's the best for me for the type of style that I'm looking for when I want my hair straight. Yeah, uh, I don't I don't like the puffy curl look where my hair is puffy up here and then I have all these curls. No, I want it straight with bouncy curls if I want the, you know, that curling effect. But it's really cool, it's beautiful. The box it came in is gorgeous. And you know, it just, it just doesn't work for what the type of look that I would be going for, that's all. Because I like the bone straight look with curls, not the kind of puffy with the curls. But the invention is really cool. I thought this was really innovative and yeah, so I hope that helps you guys see if it's something you want to purchase or not, and if it's something that'll work for you. Yeah, <laughs> so hopefully God, hopefully this helps you. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Um, I'm just going to hop back in the shower and redo my hair, and yeah, so yeah, it's a really ingenious idea, and technologically advanced which is really cool so so i will see you guys in my next video have an amazing day and thank you so much for watching bye yeah um cool it's cool just just not for me per se sorry